Hey guys, and welcome to Slash Rex Games. Today I'm going to be showing you how to wrap your player. If you're a fan of the old arcade top down shooters, you'd know uh, screen wrapping is when the player leaves on one side of the screen and pops out on the opposite side. So, firstly, let's create a sprite. This is going to be our plane sprite. So, sprite plane. And let's find a suitable sprite to airplane 5. You will do the trick. Just make sure it's cropped. Yes, that's good. Okay, so now let's find out. Let's go to the Game Maker Help. It's always a good idea to stop by here when you don't know exactly what to do. So, tap and wrap. Okay, move actions. It's a drag and drop action, so it makes it so much easier. Wrap screen with this action you can let. In instance, wrap around, that is, when it leaves one side of the room, it appears on the other side. Yes. It's used in an outside event, and it must have a speed. So if you're using H speed and V speed, or if you're just using speed in general, it has to have one of those. Otherwise, it just won't work. Uh, you can't simply change X and Y coordinates uh, with button clicks. Uh, that, that just won't work. Okay, so you have to have a speed. So let's do that. We're going to give our object some speed, and then we're going to have a, an outside event that's going to say wrap the screen and then the direction of wrapping. So let's do this now. We're going to create an object. We're going to create a room. This is going to be uh, room game world. Right there, let's give it some color. Mm, doo -doo -doo -doo. Something like that looks fine. Alright. Okay, object one, we're going to rename to object player. We're going to give it the sprite plane right there. Okay, now we're going to create some actions. So, on key press left, and we're going to have a key press right, and then a key release left. And a key release right. Okay, so we're just going to give these some code. Here we're going to say uh, H speed equals minus 10 because that's left. Okay, right is just the opposite. H speed equals 10. So that'll move in the right direction. And with these two, we just say H speed equals 0. So when we release the key, it will stop moving okay so now that we've got all those now we're going to do that outside room event add event other outside room right there we'll put it right at the top now we look for that wrap there it is it's in the move category there's wrap wrap screen drag it in applies to self direction here we go now you gotta you gotta think because we're using uh, the x coordinates here which is left and right we're gonna wrap in the horizontal we don't want to see you could wrap in both directions, but it depends on what control it's using. But anyway, we're going to use horizontal for this one. Go OK. There it is. It's right there. Now we just got to put it in our room. Let's go here. Put it smack bang right over there. Should be fine. OK. Save that. And now let's test it. OK. So there's our plane. Left and right, he moves. Now, let's see. When he gets to the edge of the screen, he pops out the other side. See, that is screen wrap. But he needs to have a speed. Otherwise, he just won't, it won't wrap at all. So that's pretty much screen wrap. Um, yeah, like I said, if you have more complex controls, you could wrap like on horizontal and vertical. Make it even more exciting. Yeah. Um, catch me next time for more game major tutorials. Like this video, comment, rate, and subscribe, tell your friends, and I'll see you later. Cheers. Your feeble efforts amuse me, human.